Hey fuckers, Gaming Leather Neck here, or AKA Young Ura. So today, I'm gonna be doing another amazing video request. I hope y'all like my cat, by the way. That's my new cat. Um, to be honest, I don't even know if I'm gonna eat it. I mean, <clears throat> excuse me, um, keep it or not. Sorry, secure that Asian in me. Um, but I hope you guys like that cat. Um, today is gonna be a video request. So, here it is. Shout out to you, Mando. Getting in it, getting it in. By the way, awesome username. Um, but he says, Hey bro, did you just call me a fucker? Yeah, I did, you fuck. Just kidding. Sort of. Um, LOL. Hey bro, how often do reserves do swim call? And in boot camp, do the heads have doors and the showers have curtains or walls? And is marine boot camp really as easy as people say? Well, first of all, that's like three video requests. So I'm gonna just do one of them and it's just gonna be the showers, okay? So. Let's get started. It's hot as balls in here, like usual. Um, so I'm shiny stuff on my head. So Marine Boot Camp showers, all right? So here's here's kind of the phase for it. So when you get into boot camp, you're gonna go through the first week, which is receiving week, which you're gonna dress all freaking retarded, you know, with everybody wearing their covers, like baseball covers or caps, and with the green skivvy shirt and unbloused trousers, which are go fasters, which is your running shoes. So those showers, depending on what company you pick up with or receives you, um, in my case, it was my company. Uh, for some other people, it was different companies. I think it was India, whatever, okay. My company, we did, we weren't rushed in our showers. We were actually just given one hour at night in, um, at night to take a shower, which is pretty nice, which is pretty lucky because I do know guys who just get rushed in their first day of boot camp, or second day or third day of boot camp when you get into receiving barracks and rush them with like friggin' a hundred something other dudes and get in, get out. And the shower only lasts for like two minutes, one minute maybe. Okay, but as you progress and you start receiving drone instructors on Black Friday, okay, it's gonna be same thing as the first week for some of you guys where you're gonna be rushed in and they're gonna count you down like 20, 90, 80, 70, 50, 50, 50, 50, blah, 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 and so on, okay, to, you know, clean yourself. So they're gonna be like, all right, you know, freaking soap on the, on your grape, ready, move. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, you wash your head, grape equals head. And then soap on your body, ready, move. And then you say kill, and then they count you down, 3, 2, 1, okay? And by the time you get out, some people, most people are all soapy as shit, okay? But here, let me give you a, let me give you a tip when you guys take a shower in boot camp, okay? When you guys take a shower in boot camp, try your best, okay, J to just wash, okay, in, when they count you down, right? This is only when you count when they count you down. Um, the shower is gonna change up later on boot camp, but I'll explain it later in the video, okay? But when they count you down, just wash your head, wash the vitals, wash your neck, wash your pits, wash the crotch, and wash the uh, places that close up, like this area between your elbows, and wash your legs uh, that close up, which is between your knees, okay? And your ass crack those are the main places that you need to clean or else you can either get a fungus or a rash okay so when you get into the shower they're gonna count you down you're going to have time to wash the areas i told you to and that's all you need for that for for those days okay because you're not gonna have enough time to wash the body off the wash the soap off your body you and you're not even gonna have time to get the vital parts i just told you about so when you get into those showers and they start counting you down all right and no there's no currents you're gonna be showering with 50 60 other dudes or in my case 110 other dudes and they're gonna count you down all right and 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 tell you to rinse off with 110 other dudes and there's not even enough shower heads all right and after you take a shower okay port side can be taking a shower and the starboard side can be freaking in the mirror room which is the sink and the mirrors okay and the, where the sunscreens are you're, they're gonna tell you to sh uh, shave and freaking brush your teeth okay so they're gonna tell you to brush your teeth and shave your freaking face and stuff like that i was asian so i didn't i didn't shave my face at all during those times i just literally stood in the middle hit my face and not fucking shave it because I, I they couldn't tell nobody could tell they did tell one time during um during drill uh they caught me with peach fuzz but they knew my tricks um, but they're gonna count you down when you shave your face and this guy some people Not just this guy people were freaking cutting themselves with the razors fuck a dumb asses, okay? Um, but that's how the showers work at boot camp. There's no currents or anything, okay? But later on in boot camp when you get when you start moving on into your uh, 
a second phase, actually no, middle of first phase, where you start getting on point with your drill movements and all that, your rifle, um, that's when, you know, they let you get that squ square raid time and shower during square raid time. It's really nice. Just make sure you can shower your whole body. You can take a shit, shit shower and shave. Okay, you can do all that in one hour and write letters and get square away for the next day. Um, and during those times, if you guys fuck up, they do threaten you guys to to uh, to you guys saying that if you want to go back to those showers again, I'm like, oh no, sir, you know. So you guys do better, cause fuck those showers. You guys come out all fucking nasty and sticky and just laying the rack, like just wishing, like, man, if I could just, if I could just get a, just one more shower. Um, I know I know a couple guys who just wetting their towel during midnight. Um, they're just wet towels. Sneak into the bathroom, wet their towels, wipe themselves off with the towel. Um, I didn't, I just fell asleep. I was freaking tired. But that's one tip I can give you guys too. If you guys sneak into the restroom with a, a foot towel, just quickly wipe that stuff off because it's just gonna feel sticky all night. Um, but that's about it and for boot camp showers. Um, they're gonna tell you to put this chemical on your body in the beginning to um, get rid of all the nasty germs that's brought over from all over the country. Um, so, but don't put, they're going to tell you where to put it. Don't put it, they tell you, don't put it on your crotch, your face and all that stuff is going to burn like shit. So, um, that's about it to be honest. Oh, well, quick story guys. Uh, when I was, when I was doing that, the, the everybody's getting grouped together and kept down into showers. I had one of the worst experience ever. It, this guy, I, I still remember his name. Like he was a, he was a cool dude, but I mean, in the most heterosexual way. Like something really homo be happened between me and him, and I just, I still remember to this day. He, we rushed into the shower, and I think I had to borrow a soap or something. So we were really freaking close together, and they're counting us down, and his dick it was so cramped because there's a hundred something of us, or no, actually no, like half the platoon, which is like 60, 50 of us in that one shower, which is like only like 10, 15 he uh, shower heads, about, and this his dick rubbed on me over and over again uh, because we were so clamped up and we were, I was like, no, holy fuck, please. And he was like, dude, I'm sorry. Like, I, I, it just happened. It, was, it wasn't it wasn't over. It was for like two seconds. It was just like, psh, 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 psh. I was like, oh fuck, it's like a slug, you know? <laughs> it was all slimy and shit from all that soap and water combined together. I was like, oh my gosh, dude. Like, hey, <laughs> pretend it never happened. He's like, all right, let's fuck that, bro. I was like, yep. Um, oh yeah, there's another, um, way they shower you is after PT, uh, you're all sweaty and nasty. They'll tell you to, everybody, to strip down everything, all your gear and count down. And they'll tell you to set up the wagon wheel, which you're gonna wagon wheel. So there's the uh, shower heads on top and it's a shit like that. And uh, it's like, you guys, they tell you to go in a circle. It's, just, it's it, the shower heads are placed like a circle, okay? Like a half circle. They tell the first recruit to lead, to lead, the, other, to lead the platoon around the showers and wagon wheel it out and you literally only get like half your body wet which is disgusting and they tell you to put this cologne on called cobra it smells pretty good in my opinion and we use that for field day but anyways that's all the, that's all i have for you for showers if i have any more stories which i 100 percent i do have more sto shower stories i lost seeing a lot of shit in the showers and during boot camp uh, especially towards the end of it where everybody's getting all comfortable with each other uh, but i'll share that more for later i'll just label the title like shower stories or something crap like that but anyways if you guys like the video thumbs up if you guys didn't thumbs down i don't give a fuck stay sharp be safe and remember good play these kills thanks for watching Oorah.